Hi everyone. The Midheaven represents your reputation. It represents your public persona and how people basically perceive you. The tenth house has to do with work because a lot of the work that you put in is the work that you put into life is put out in the tenth house. Torians usually don't have a necessarily bad reputation or people don't really perceive them in a bad way without having first met them because Taurus is ruled by Venus or Venus rules Taurus, vice versa. Taurus is ruled by Venus, therefore it forms good friendships and relationships as Venus does. And it's difficult for Taurus to have this bad perception of themselves due to having Venus as the ruler, I guess it's, and it's, mo and it's the same with Libra as well. Libra is even more elevated with having a quote unquote good reputation. And because Taurus presents themselves in their first house, if you have a Taurus rising, as aesthetically pleasing. They take great care in how they present themselves and the calming and nurturing. And in the 10th house that you're kind of, you're basically perceived as that way if people haven't met you. So say, for example, through your Instagram, you may have aesthetically pleasing photos and um, photos of you going out traveling or just you present yourself on Instagram or any social media as someone that is that cares about aesthetics and that cares about art and presenting yourself in a calming way. Now, this doesn't mean necessarily that you are materialistic in how you present yourself, as in you only post a photo if you are if you got a new car or if you got new shoes. That's not what I mean. In the negative way, it can manifest as that, but in the positive way, as in you take great care of how you present yourself and you really want people to see you in a way that's not controversial or like you care more what people think than others I guess and you care a bit more what other people think of you and it's difficult for you to kind of be seen as mean you come off as nice and people per and you per people perceive you as nice most of the time, unless there's other things in your chart, such as squares or oppositions, bad aspects to your Venus or Mars or other personal planets like that, it's difficult for you to come off as mean or abrasive. It's People usually perceive you as calm, artistic, aesthetically pleasing, nice, and caring. Now the workplace, which is the other side of the midheaven. You have the reputation, public persona, and the workplace, which go hand in hand more than you think. A Taurus midheaven in work is usually very dependable, and they're very hardworking, although it may not come off of that on the surface, because a Taurus's method of working is usually very long-term, and not so much that you'll see them all the time, like, writing things down on their computer. Like, you're not going to see them 24-7 at their computer, because as Taurus, Taurians are, they're not... As Taurians are, they're not fast to get to where they want to. They're usually slow working, hard working, but they get there step by step and they don't like rushing themselves too much. They like taking their time. And in a long term perspective, that's a very good aspect to have in the, in the workplace, as in projects will always be done, maybe not on time or at the pace that the workplace wants it to, but that makes a Taurus midheaven very loyal and very dependable to get the work done. And, and that someone that they can rely on in the workplace and that and they make um, pretty good bosses because they are determined and they are able to stick with the responsibility that they're given themselves. Torians usually like stable jobs, um, ones that don't have very changing environments or versatile environments. They don't, they won't really thrive somewhere that's changing every day and that they have to rework their work ethic, change their project, work on something new every day. They're not so much the ones to do that. If they are in like a relatively stable, if they're in a relatively stable job, that's like one type of Taurus. One I would say is the more um, ones that are like accounting or finance, like working for a business is kind of a good place for a Taurus to be where they can slowly work up and they don't have to rush things. I think that's a really good environment for a Taurus that wants something more stable. Um, whereas another type of Taurus midheaven could be the one that's very artistic and one that likes making paintings or drawing, sculpting, all kinds of ways that they can express themselves because Taurus, as I said, is ruled by Venus. So that makes them very artistic and creative. And if they're able to express themselves in that way without pressure from others, 
that makes them really thrive because it's a stable job as in maybe not stable income but it's a stable job where they know they'll be able to express themselves and be able to produce art or any creative visions that they have without fail because they are an endless outlet of creativity another option for the more creative tourist midheaven would be yoga or any type of class that they can teach where they can alter the mind and body and help calm people down and to just center them and ground them because that those are Torian's great characteristics is their ability to ground people and to just calm them down. And kind of yoga and mind-body class is really great for a Taurus just to take often or just to be able to teach because it's very stable and it's something that they're able to create, to express themselves in, and to calm themselves at the same time. And it has that beneficial give and, give and take that um, Torians are usually want. A Taurus midheaven can suffer as I said, in a fast-changing environment. Um, and that includes in the workplace. They won't thrive somewhere where everything's changing because it'll be hard for them to adapt because Taurians do not like change. No matter what placement, a Taurus, any placement will not like change. And when it's in your midheaven, you do not want change in your workplace environment. And Taurians don't like change. That's why they'll want a job where it'll be stable and they won't, won't want a job they won't want a career that is always changing and one that they can't just ground themselves in and stick their feet in the ground and stay there. In summary, a tourist manager makes a very trustworthy and hardworking individual or an employee or boss. This energy shines through almost any job that they take as long as they're happy and they're not overwhelmed by different stresses and heavily changing environments. Uh, their blessing of a good reputation will get, usually get them very far in life as long as it hasn't been ruined already or something and it will advance them very farther, very much far in their career if they're able to keep it that way. That's all for Taurus Midheaven everyone. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, leave a comment on your leave a comment on your experience as a Taurus Midheaven if you want. I'd love to hear honestly and uh, I hope to see you guys in the Gemini Midheaven video and any upcoming videos. Bye!